Today we're going to install the wall mount of Dyson V15. So first you're gonna take out that white thing that is where your screw and then here is the manual. So all you have to do is just make a measurement from the bottom going to the top for 120 cm. There you go. So after we measure this one, of course, we're going to mark where it is and then we're going to drill. I'm using uh, the electric drill anyways to make it more easier. So I'll just make a small hole in it before I attach the one part. There you go. And then I'm gonna use a hammer to make it goes all the way in so we're going to do the same thing on the top side we're in on the manual it said that from here at the bottom we're going to measure for another five inches going up after we mark it, we're going to measure the side too, so make sure everything is balanced. So we're just going to adjust the mark that we did. There you go. So it all level. And after that, of course, I'm going to drill it again. Just repeat the same process. Now that we are done, we're going to attach the first part of the wall mount there you go so basically i'm not using the drill here i'm using the screw there you go so i'm not gonna tighten it up for now so we need to put the other one on the top and then once all okay then that's the time we're going to tighten it up there you go so now that we are done next uh, we're going to put the wire on the second part of the wall mount there you go so all you have to do guys is just put the tip of the charger inside so what we have to do is at the end of the charger this one you have to put it inside so as you can see that hole so you put it in there you go you put it inside here so that is what it looks see so you put it in and close it there you go and and you hear that click there you go that means it's locked so that will be in the front and here is in the back so you just to realign and just snap it and follow this line there you go here you have it now Everything's ready. As you can see, this should go inside this one. You can see in that one. This. Here you go. So I have to just snag it in. So when you hear the click one, that means it is locked so now that we are done we're going to attach the charger so now that we are done i'm going to attach some of the accessories here at the bottom part and then i'm going to put our dyson on top as you can see that blue blinking that means it is charging so everything is working perfectly fine so by following the manual how to put this wall mount of the dyson guys uh, take note there is a gap on it as you can see at the bottom part there you go so if you don't if you don't want to have this kind of gap you don't have to follow that measurement but make sure to measure your dyson length and the brush that you're gonna attach before uh putting a hole on the wall so you can basically just adjust the measurement if you don't want that gap so that's it guys 
this is how it looks like